It's Walter Martin back, helping you find the best sales and deals on used cars in your particular area. I've been going throughout much of Minnesota, and today we're going to go into the Superior or Lake Superior area. So go to google.com and type in Craigslist Superior M Minnesota and hit enter. And you're going to see it's actually the Duluth Superior Craigslist page. So go ahead and click there. And you're going to see Duluth Superior up top, search Craigslist on the left, nearby Craigslist on the right if you can't find what you're looking for on this particular one. But I always go to the for sale and I click on cars and trucks and I go to the buy owner only section. And you're going to quickly see why the buy owner only section is the place to go. So today on Sunday we're already seeing several listings and some as low as $1,300. Here's $1,500 for an old Jeep Cherokee. So you could drive around quite a bit looking for an older vehicle under $1,500 that runs and you may really struggle to find it. The worst part about it is is you would have to use used car salesmen to find this particular vehicle and you know sitting at home you could find the vehicle in less than 15 minutes by doing a little bit of research. Anything that is under $1,500 or $2,000 I would suggest reading the entire sales ad and making 100% certain that the vehicle runs. A lot of the time, people will be selling vehicles for $800 and $700, and they may just be for sale for parts or for the frame or whatever. But this one looks like it does run. I would also suggest making certain that there are no major issues that are going to cost a lot of money. You know, if they say the transmission needs work or it needs engine help, you know, that's going to get quite expensive. So, those are just a few things you want to note. Something else I'll point out is OBO. A lot of classified ads on Craigslist will have OBO beside it. Basically what that means is the sellers are willing to take a best offer. OBO stands for or best offer. If they're not getting any or any type of um, interest at the price that they're setting it now, there's a good chance they will be able to lower the price or you can get it for $1,400 or $1,300. If you have cash in hand, you can always save money. They're not going to let you walk away if you have $1,400. And here's something also very common. You're going to see a lot of Chevy and Ford trucks. No matter where you're looking at, Minnesota, North Carolina, Texas, you're going to find plenty of trucks on Craigslist. Just always make sure to do your research and find a vehicle that works out for you. So these are just a few tips and tricks I like to use when searching Craigslist for used cars. Please feel free to comment below and please the like Please like the video on YouTube if you find it.